Hello everybody, my name is Melandria Sherwin, and welcome to Let's Play The Novelty Crook Chapter 1, The Horse You Sailed In On. Alright, so first and foremost, I want to thank the developer for letting me play this and letting me record it for you guys. Thank you so much if you ever play this, if you ever see this video, you've obviously played this game. Thank you so much, I really appreciate it. Alright, so before we go into anything else, uh, just a, kind of a quick uh, info about this game. It's an indie horror point and click. Uh, I believe it's 8 bit or something. Uh, it's free to play on Steam, and uh, I'm really excited because this is actually my first horror game I've ever played. Uh, well, first horror PC in a really long time. Actually, the first one I ever played was Phantasmagoria, and if you guys know anything about that game, first of all, it's scary as heck, at least to me. And uh, it's an older PC game where they actually have had live action in, in combination with CGI. Uh, I believe it was released probably in the late 90s, I want to say. Um, so it still creeped me out and scared me and still had nightmares for weeks. So I'm hoping that that's not the case with this one. Uh, so as far as the synopsis is concerned, uh, there really wasn't one, uh, unless I missed it. Um, so, apparently, I, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what to do, so it's going to be a learning experience for both of us. So, here we go. That guy is really super creepy. Just want to point that out right now. Uh, with the skull, like, half face, I don't know. Okay, come on, mouse, where are you? Mouse, hello. Sorry, sorry about that. I apologize. I don't know what happened. Uh, okay, anyway. Okay, here we go. New game. Here we go. Whoa. I am ready to hear your confession. Creepy. Yeah. Is that me? Uh, okay. Uh, forgive me, Padre. I really don't want to touch him. I don't want to touch anything either in this game. I don't blame him. Hey, Alasha. Hey, I can't. Hey, yeah. can I sit? Nope. Damn it, phone. Stop it. Sorry. 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 Sorry, people are texting me. Uh. Uh. Bodily function. Sorry. Weird, gargly, grainy, gibberish. Alright. Yeah. No. Yeah. Oh, no. 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 Oh, Okay, apparently that was the thing I needed to click on. Alright. I guess. Oh, I can actually the one of those. I'm sorry if the uh, if the music in the game is actually a little bit louder than my talking. I actually tried to get into it. There's really no options button for me, so just the music is just as loud and stuff as it is. So I apologize if it's too loud, and I'm apologizing in advance if you can't hear me later on. Okay. It's a That's safety instructions? There's safety instructions? What? Alright. Draw attention to that. I don't even know what that is. I don't know what anything is. Hey, can I sit? Nope. Yeah. 
I'm not doing anything spectacular. Alright. Okay, what the What the heck? What the heck am I supposed to do? Okay. Um
I do whatever this goofy voice tells me to do. Hold on to your, uh, squid hat and prepare for an epic tale of something. I can't read it because my camera's in the way. Some folks are born great, others have greatness come crashing down on them. I'm guessing that's what that's Like most great stories, it starts with a damp hole. That's what she said. Oh, okay. <laughs> ah, as I'm spitting everywhere. Hold on to your squid hat and prepare for a tale of epic something. Sure, let's go with that one. Monumentosity. I can word. Hmm. Ocean at the cave's end, just like the spooky voice described. I should be tending to my clock right now. But here I am, following voices. That's your cute voice. Sai. Can't wait for my name, for my naming day now. Osiris the Loon. Osiris the Sea. Okay, my name is Osiris. Osiris the Self Conversationalist. Ugh. You will have a much bigger name than that. Yes! Spooky voice has a spooky face! Perfect! You have much, we have much to discuss. Who are you? Are you me? No. You are me. How is it? Sounds like an Asian dragon. You must come to me at the peak of the Naomi Hey! Game title! Yay! Right. Sure. Uh, I'm just gonna... Now. Osiris, the good heaven. Osiris, the never one. Both are apt names. Alright, stop! How do I even get there? It's a long swim. Of course. Seems legit. Alright. That's it? Horse. Whoa. Hey! You're creepy looking! Yay, Dr. One! Ah, the horse is sailed in on. So a horse it is. Hey, can you drop me off at the Nobbly Crook? It was worth a shot. I'll get a little closer. Yeah, let's let's go closer to the scary robot dude with spatulas and oven mitts and a weird pet. Bits. He said, Do you know anything about Gummer Lones? I need to get to the Nobly Group. Never mind. Sorry about that. This is so cool! Like, you have different options. You, you don't just, like, just go up to a random NPC and they just tell you what to say. The game just tells you what to say. You actually get to kind of choose your own. That's so cool. I need to get to the Nobly we just came for the novel. This boat is speeding to the Gumberlung Champion. To the Gumberlung Champion. Perhaps you should have done more boat hopping in the other direction. Ah, you saw that, did you? Clearly. How do I get it to turn around? Short of an emergency, there's no way Captain Sextant will reverse the horse. He's got a reputation to uphold. Right. An emergency it is, then. Wait. Wait. <laughs> nice bit! Indeed. You have many pouches. 
don't have a bochato. I have a pouch too. Sure you. I'm sure you're very proud. <laughs> So weird. This is so weird. Oh my gosh. Oh man, this is all, oh man, this is so weird. A cool horse boat thing. Talk to this person. Contraband. Can you and me? 
I threw a Nullidine luggage. I threw a luggage. It's probably full of illegal weapons. If we get a boost of speed, you'll know why. Alright!
guy. I in the other direction. I feel like I have a kind of whispery voice. I need to turn the boat around. Thank you guys very much again, and I hope to see you guys soon. Bye!